facial scrub with this mask and then when I finish that I go back in and I pat the mask on my skin I just pack it on my skin and then I'm gonna sit with this to dry this is gonna dry my skin for about 30 minutes We're gonna tighten the sagging jawline, lift those cheekbones, and we're gonna help you to get your skin to look years younger. What I'm gonna make for you is a simple recipe. Yes, a very simple recipe that any one of you can make at home. For this remedy, I'm using simple ingredients, simple ingredients that are rich in vitamins and minerals that is great for your skin. So, what are you waiting for? Follow me to my kitchen. I'm gonna share the full detail recipe recipe and I'm also going to share a live demonstration at the end showing you how to get the best result from using this mask on your skin. It's a must watch and a must try so continue. Now my first ingredient is sesame seed and sesame seed will help to exfoliate, get rid of dead skin cells. It is rich in vitamin A, vitamin C and vitamin E. It helps to boost the collagen production in the skin and also reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. For this recipe you can use sesame sesame seed, flax seed or chia seeds. So I'm going to blend two tablespoons of the sesame seeds and you can choose to use the white or you can choose to use the black sesame seed for this recipe. Now once this is blended we're going to put this aside and move on to the next ingredient. Now today we're going to be using some flour and this is plain white flour. Flour will have to tighten the skin. So we're gonna use two tablespoons of flour, adding this to our bowl. Next, we're gonna reach for some orange peel, and this is orange peel powder, rich in vitamin C. We're using one teaspoon of the orange peel powder, adding that to our bowl. So here in our bowl, we have orange peel and flour, and now we're gonna reach back for our sesame seeds. And we're going to pour this in the bowl. So here we have flour, sesame seed, and orange peel. We're going to give this a stir. And now what we're going to do next, we're going to reach for our saucepan. And we're going to place our pot on the stovetop. Next we're going to pour one cup of water in the saucepan. Now before it start boiling, we're going to reach for the flour, orange peel and sesame seed mixture. And we're going to slowly pour this in the saucepan. You want to mix as you go along. Just pour it in. And this has a very pleasant fragrance. You're going to get rid of all the lumps. You need to work very fast with this. Just keep stirring this. Keep stirring. And once you start stirring, you're going to notice that it's going to get thick. This is how you want it to be. So keep stirring this. And while you are stirring, and it's getting really, really thick, we're going to reach for some avocado oil. So I'm going to pour about a teaspoon of the avocado oil in the mixture. You can use any of your favorite oil. We do not need a lot of oils in this since the sesame seed is rich in oils. So mix and mix well. If it needs a little bit more water, you don't want it to be too, too thick. You can go ahead and add a little bit more water to it. And now we're gonna remove this from the stove top. As soon as you remove this, you're gonna keep stirring. Now take a look, here it is. 
after we remove it from the stove top and you're gonna set this aside to cool once it is cooled then it is ready to use on the skin however I like to store mine in a storage jar reach for the storage jar and let's pour this in Now for this facial mask, you will need to use it up in seven days and you're going to store this in the refrigerator. This mask is a skin tightening mask. When you apply it on your face, it's going to leave a tightening sensation. It's going to dry on the skin and it's going to leave the skin firm and tight. And to use the mask, you want to apply it on your skin like I'm showing here. And it have a very pleasant fragrant so you're just going to apply it all over your face a thick layer be generous with it this feel really really good guys and once this is done you are going to let it dry on the skin now because we're short on time guys what we will need to know is that when this is dry on the skin, it's going to be hard on the skin. You are going to get this tightening effect on the skin. It's going to be so dry on the skin. Not to worry, that is the mask working on the skin. So rinse the mask off, pat dry, and you apply your favorite moisturizer. This mask is good to use two to three times a week. If you're just starting out and you want to try the mask for seven days straight, go ahead and do so. However, you need not to use it more than two to three times a week and you're still going to reap amazing benefits. So whip it up, make it up, use it up, and come back and leave.